Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sashina Beauty. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button because I don't know if you know, girl, but I bring you affordable hair, makeup, and clothes on a budget. But if you're oldie and a goodie, thank you for rocking with me. Let's jump right into this video. Now, the wig on my head is not a um, synthetic unit like a normal review as you've seen before. Um this is actually a wig review and i'm going to show you how i put this wig on and everything this wig was sent to me by new beauty here um this unit is a lace front unit it is a natural wave in a natural color and it's in the um in the lint number 20. throughout the video i forgot to mention this yes i know this is here yes i know she popped up yes i know she ain't invited but she here she ain't going nowhere um, anyways, I want to say thank you for New Beauty for sending me this here to review. Um, to get 10% off your order, there is a coupon code down below. It is Beauty10 to get 10% off. Um, this here is really nice, guys. And you're going to see how I install it. It was really, really fun doing something like this. Normally, I just put that wig on my head and I don't show you guys the construction and how to install it. So if you're interested in how to see more about this unit and how I got it to look how it looks, um, keep on watching. They do have a sale going on now. I'm looking at on my phone. And girl, they got a hot bob wigs starting at $55. Like, I don't know um, if you are aware, but um, that is dirt, dirt cheap. Like, $55 for a bob, a human here bob at that. That is pretty, pretty amazing. The wig on my head, though, um, she is a hundred and eighty four uh, and she pretty good i mean for the price of this unit that, that that's that, that that's pretty crazy that that's that's amazing so um yeah guys check out the beauty leave me a comment down below everything for this unit and for um the wig is in the description box they're an amazing company they're really sweet they're really nice and yeah check this out guys um keep on watching i am on a whole nother level girl he only fought you over because you let him girl, i guess he didn't know any better girl that man didn't show me ever do what i can just hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Tashina beauty if you're new to my channel please hit the subscribe button because i don't know if you know girl but i bring you affordable hair on a budget and if you're oldie but a goodie thank you for rocking with me let's jump right into this video now um today i'm actually reviewing a hair that's sent to me by a company called the beauty um, no, I think it's Na Beauty. I'm not sure, but it's N A B E U T Y, and the box looked like this. Now, um, this company did reach out to me, and I got a chance to pick what I wanted in a wig and the length, and they then um, send it to me. Um, I really like their packaging. This video was was supposed to be out for a while now, but um, it hasn't. So. I do apologize. I believe this is going to be like oh, a little bit later. Um, I'm hoping to get it out today, but I'm not sure because I have some stuff coming up. So if not, I'm pretty sure it's going to be late. Um, so I do apologize for that in advance. And I'm really, really sorry about that. Now, um, this, this is what the packaging looked like. Now, I do have to tell you that I did actually open this already um, because I had to do some stuff to it. So that's what it looks like when you open the box. Um, in the box, oops, sorry. They did send me this stock card. Um, this card actually has like the official site, their Instagram. You can follow them on Instagram at um, Na Beauty Hair Official. Um, you get fun updates and stuff like that. And on the back of it, it just says, Dear Na Beauty Lover, we are so excited to have you with us and can't wait to see you slay. We hope that you have a pleasant shopping experience. Na Beauty Young Advent Grad Luxury, always leading the hairstyles with its free um, various and new styles. Hairstyle refuses to be boring. Protect hair to enjoy life. Hair is boom. 
is born for love we sincerely invite you to slay the wonderful word of hair world of hairs no beauty here official and it's no beauty here dot com i think that was cute i like when companies do stuff like that i do order human hairs offline I'm happy they reached out to me because honestly, I think I'll be purchasing from them. And I told a few people already and they too will be purchasing from them. And in there, they also sent me um, some mink lashes. It's your eyes are amazing, beautiful and glamorous. It's a 100% natural um, mink fur, 100% uh, handmade. And it's also by Na Beauty. So they also have lashes on their website. Check them out for that too. In the box comes um, stocking cap, a wig cap, and it's in the color, what color is this? I think this is like tan. It doesn't say what color it is, um, but I'll, that's why I don't have anything on my head because I'm going to be using this. Now, the hair did come better packaged than what it is because I put it back in the box, but um, I took it out already. Plucked. I didn't pluck, actually, to be honest with you. Um, <clears throat> but I did do something to it. So, this is what the hair comes like. Um, I did not wash it because I wanted you to see the curls naturally for it. Um, if you get, if you see any shedding, which there isn't really any, is because I actually kind of, when I was sewing the band to it, I slid it a little bit, but that it wasn't shedding before. It's actually really soft, very nice, very good texture. This is a natural wave, and it is in a natural color, and it's in the length 20. Uh, I will say it's true to length because um, even though it hits me like almost like an 18, it's because it's a wavy texture, which is completely fine. Um, let me show you what the inside of the cap look like. So this band right here. This band right here did not come attached to it. I actually sewed this on. They did send me the perfect length. My head circ circ circumference is actually a 22. So I needed the band to be at eight, eight and a half, eight point five 8.5 inches. And it was perfect. So I just sewed it on. So if you need to know the specs on how to put a band, I will actually leave that down below. Um, I got this from... I can't remember her name, a YouTuber who actually tells you um, the perfect band size for your head. Um, inside of the cap, right? So you got, this is a lace front toe. So you have um, your lace front, sorry, ignore the band that I have. So you got two combs right here and a comb right there and an adjustable strap in the back and inside of the cap looks like this and obviously i did attach um my headband my band to it already um this is what the front of the wig looks like i don't know if you can see that but it actually is already pre-plucked it is a natural hairline wig this is so soft you guys like it is really nice it's not you can run your hand through it it's really not a you know what i mean like it is completely different from any synthetic unit or any human hair that i've tried normally i'd go for a wavy texture not um not not that your wavy texture, like a more like a body wave. So it's like that smooth drop curl texture. That's what I normally go for. Um, so we're, I'm going to show you how I normally install my natural wigs. However, I will not be gluing this down. So I will show you how it looks without me gluing it down. Um, if you want to glue it down, you can always use got to be glue or something like that. So for this, guys, you're going to need. Sorry, I'm going to move some stuff around here. For this, you're going to need your clips. I have two. Let me see if I can find the other one. Where did this appear to? Okay, you know me. If you're new to my channel, hey, my name is Sashina Beauty. I tend to have a lot of stuff unprepared some of the time. So, I got two clips. Um, <clears throat> a baby toothbrush. This nobody using this for their teeth. Okay, my kids don't use this. Um, I got my a pair of scissors a comb because I cannot find my um, tail comb and I got me uh, my eyebrow thingy majiggy you use this to shape your eyebrows I have one of those and I have my foam in lotion okay because I'm not using got to be glue now they give me a really good nude cap so I'm taking that 
this is a really nice tan color two of them comes in this pack and I'm just going to put that on my head I need my mirror to so if you see anything looking crazy don't judge me I will be looking down because I need my mirror for this part Okay. And then I pull this up so the, like right here, my hair is showing. Um, because I don't have, um, a, I would say a perfect hairline because my hair grows down to here. So I have like literally not even a finger of space right there, right? Like, so one time my hair salesman made a joke after me, a Jamaican, and she said that, I don't even have three fingers of forward space, which I'm okay with that. At least I got here on my head, girl. No tea, no shade, okay? Um, so um, there's two th th wait, ways I normally do this. I either put the foundation on the wig or I put it on my um, cap. I think I'm going to put it on the wig this time though just to see what it looks like I think I might put a little bit so let me grab my um, foundation because I forgot to grab that I'm back so I'm grabbing my Maybelline fit me in the color uh, mocha it's a mocha powder in the color 360 this is what it looks like now this has been abused quite a lot and I'm grabbing my real techniques um, expert face brush and I'm taking that and I'm actually gonna brush with quite a few over the stocking cap just to blend it out. Now you want to get something that's close to your skin color, um, whatever that may be. This is what's close to my skin color. This is not my scalp color, but it's my skin color because you want it to look like um, it's it's your natural hair, even though it ain't. So okay, so you, you're trying your best to come up with an illusion. So I'm taking. The wig, and I'm taking, and I'm brushing that all over the lace, okay? Because we're trying to get it to look like, yeah. So I'm just, I think I might be fast forwarding this part, and if I'm not holding up the wig in front of the camera, I apologize, but I do want to get this all over.
Okay, so I'm back, guys. Now, I did cut the two parts that would normally land over my ears because, yeah, I don't... I don't like the feeling, um, and I already have enough hair there. So I normally cut that part off when I'm here wearing my human hair wigs. Um, yeah. Okay. That's pretty flat. Now, if you want, you can tack this down. As I said before, you can see that I have a lot of hair there, so I am not going to.